All right, chat. We're back into Crash Bandicoot. Crash Bandicoot 2. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're beating the game today. I said that freaking yesterday. But today, I mean it. And that's the difference. Dear Meg, My... I hope work has calmed down lately. I know you've been missing streams, and it's tough not being able to hang out with the gang, but I appreciate all you work especially in these trying times. Keep being poggers, you pog person, you. <laughs> Keep being poggers, you pog person, you. I agree. I now understand. My batteries are still dead. They're not rechargeable batteries. I'm a dummy. Uh, we'll plug in the controller and just do it this way. <laughs> Stop. Lost, thank you so much for the thousand chats and the very kind words to Meg. Keep being poggers, you pog person, you. Now I'm going to cry. We love you, Meg. We love you. And you're doing great. You're doing great. It's been a rough... We've been talking about it, Meg. We've been talking about how rough a week it's been. Way harder for you than it's been for me, and I don't feel like I've had a good week, you know? It's just been a lot. You're doing great, sweetie. You are doing great, Meg. Hanging out. This is where we died yesterday. We're beating the game today. We're going to start it off on the most wholesome meme... Wholesome... Wholesome moment that there has ever been. Which is lost TTS right there. Oh, not this shit again. I remember this now. I was like, what's this level again? I remember it. Electric eels. Electric eels. It's very sweet of you, lost. Thank you, man. I appreciate the good vibes. Uh, hey, Meg, do you like tennis? I bet she likes it. Hear me out. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to speak for her, but I bet she does. Table tennis, on the other hand. Okay, we get out of here. We're wholesome now. We're wholesome now. We're wholesome. Wholesome is the meta. Did you know that? Wholesome is the new meta on the internet. It's actually. Penises have been wholesome all day. They've been wholesome all day. I paused and thought about stuff around the world that's going on. Uh, I wanted to send a message. Oh, dude. I knew where you were going, Tom. I know you. It's like we've spent a couple hours. It's th it's like we've spent a couple hours together. It's sweet of you, Lost. Oh, buddy. It's very sweet of you. Jesus. Oh no! Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're not raging this early. We're not raging this early. Oh! Alright, this is our warm up run. Uh, it's our warm up run. It's our warm up run. I didn't mean to do that. Nope. Connor spent night. Connor is approaching his hundredth hour. Ho holy, holy! Connor approaches the hundredth hour here as a part of the cult, as a part of the little into cult. Yo, Doc, how's it going? Take care of yourself, Meg. Take some you time and relax. Know that you're surrounded by people who love and support you and dogs. It may be hard, but know that we are all here. Also, Lost was right. Keeping poggers, you pog person, you. Hi, Doc. It's a very sweet message, Doc. Thank you. It's a warm-up run because you get roasted and electrocuted, too. Both. It turns out. <laughs> yes. Um. Oh! Mistakes are made. It's fine. Mistakes are made. It's okay. We just spin through them. It's really all you do. You just... Oh, another life. Thank you. Thank you so much. Cat spent 40... Th a working week here? Oh, my God. Oh my god. Doug, how's it going? Thank you so much for the sweet message, man. I'm sure Meg heard it. Um, I don't think she's left yet. Did you remind me of somebody? Who is it, Jorben? Jorben, is it? Uh, let me guess here. Mm, Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> I tried to pick the person farthest from whom I am. Matthew McConaughey. I get that all the time. That I look like Matthew McConaughey. Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> ah, 
We're fine. Chris Hemsworth. There you go. Thank you, Panda, for that. Is it Avril Lavigne? It's definitely Avril Lavigne. Pulled 800, man. Oh my god. Tub has spent 800 hours here. Wow. She. Meg says I'm driving and crying. Uh, at least it's not the first cries of the week, you know? Oh, that's a bad jump. Oh, we made it anyways. It's fine. You remind me of a young version of Rivers Cuomo. Yeah, I'll take it. Let's go. Rivers Cuomo? I'll fucking take it, dude. Let's go. Pog comparison. Thank you, Jorben. You rem remind me of a young... Uh, I don't know. I don't know how to start this. I don't know how to start this. Popping in for a second before my movie club starts. Today we're watching The White Ribbon, a black and white German film from 2009 about a small village right before World War One. Yes, we're getting snobby in here. We getting snobby in here. It depends on the picture, I would say, uh, Jorben. I think it depends on the picture. Uh, for instance, hypothetically, uh, I would say less so... That's... Does it say Finn? That's Finn Wolfhard. That's why I don't look like him. Uh, I would say yesish, for sure. I would say yesish when my hair was longer. Um, young Rivers Cuomo. Oh my god. Yesish, for sh for sure. This is young Ben Gibbard. Yes, for sure. Um, yeah. I think that's accurate. You can slide under the boxes, Tub says. Um, we love you too, Megan. Um, mm, a TNC box. Gotcha. Hi, Martin. How's it going? I knew you looked familiar, he says. Hi, Martin. Okay, where is it? We go as far. And then we follow. Then we follow. Follow, 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 follow. How's it going, Martin? Panda says, I love that movie. Oh my god, Panda, you're so literate. Except whatever literate is for movies. You look like a regular American NPC to me. Sure, I'll take it. I've got the magic in me. Every time it, it, it something turns into gold. That's not Rivers Cuomo, is it? <laughs> Ryan, you kind of remind me of that guy from YouTube who used to review books. I think I might be able to just go forward. No, it definitely takes me back up. I don't remember. Let's try it. This is the bonus level, right? No? Not the bonus. This is where you get all those lives. That's right. I used to review books. Doesn't sound like me, honestly. Is there a duck? <gasps> wow. Can you just crawl above? I bet you can. Magic, 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 MMM, magic, magic. Sorry, the focus is so fucking real right now. Oh my god, I'm cracked. I'm cracked at Crash Bandicoot these days! Uh, this guy's fucking moving! He's zooming! Oh god! Oh god! He's zooming! Wow. I'll say that I made a W comparison. You made a W compar comparison, Jordan. Cat, thanks so much for the five bits, by the way. Magic, magic. Mm -mm -mm. Matt. Where the fuck did I just go? Hi, our monkey. How's it going? Are we talking about the same song, Martin? It's B.O.B. and Rivers Cuomo. Is it actually? This is a warp thing? Where do I go? Can I go down? I mean, it says I can go up. Pick one, but I have this one. I have this one. 
I have this one. It won't let me go in there. So I just beat this. So now do I go up? I don't know. This brought me back. Yeah, but these are warps. Okay, you said warp thing, but I don't know what that means. Hi, right, monkey. Hope you're having a great day. <clears throat> you should have picked one. I can still do it. I just, uh, I'm here. Guys, I don't know if you know this, but the lives counter goes in the double digits, and Ryan might actually get to see that for a change. No shit, our monkey? No way. We're close. Okay, so I've done these, though. So, like... I haven't done this one. Let's try. Friendly fireflies will help you... help light your way. Oh, God. Oh, God. The timer? God. I need to slide jump that. I get it now. Okay. Alright. Ryan had like 13 yesterday. I mean, not for very long if I did. Oh, no. Oh, we did it. Holy shit. Didn't think we had that in us. Mm, I slid off. Watch out for the rats. Watch out for the hogs, by the way. Hi, our monkey. How's it going? Hope you've had a great day. Oh, shit. Well, this doesn't hurt my lives, technically, so that's good. Is this going to take me longer to beat the game, though? Listen, Crash, I appreciate the, like, hey, you're doing great, you get this bonus level, but hear me out. All I want to do is beat this game. Uh, this is the guy we slide. Uh, oh, God. Uh, ugh! so I never have to rage again. Oh. Never have to rage again until I until I rage at Crash. That's the one you fucking do. Until I rage again at Crash Three. It's just focus. It's just focus. It's just focus. How am I not doing it? It's fine. The the rat just goes flying when you slide it or when you spin it either. I don't need to slide jump that. I know for a fact. All right, there we go. This one I do. It's fine. Hold the button. Back to basics. Back to basics. I do like sending him flying. Panda, you're right about that. Say, so we let this guy... Oh, no. We let this guy come towards us, then away. Then we get him. We get the firefly. Oh, God. What are you doing? Oh, God. I'm scared. What is this? Okay, I don't know. It gave me a second. Oh, I don't care about my time. Let's... Oh, no. As you can tell. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. This is new territory, chat. I don't know what the fuck's going on here. Oh! Okay, we've hit a minute. That's fine. I'm losing my light, though. What's this thing do? No? Okay. Oh, buddy! Hear me out. Since the PC is a machine, does that mean you're raging against the machine? I rage against the machine every day of my life, uh, our monkey. Some of us rage in, like, in, like, real important ways. I rage in, uh, in very small ways. I like the new Ratchet and Clank. It's so shiny. New Ratchet and Clank? Yeah? Too much focus. Too much focus. Ratchet and Clank was a cartoon as well, right? Oh, I forgot. Sometimes I face a, a problem and I'm like, oh yeah, you know what? You have what it takes, Ryan. You're like a relatively intelligent person. Not that intelligent, but like enough to get by. And you definitely have, you know, a couple things at your disposal that you could do to get yourself through this problem. 
And then sometimes I face problems and I'm just like, you're fucked, bud. You're very fucked. Crash is one of those problems. Gotta go back to work for a minute. Love you all. Love you, Mag. See ya. Shit. Ouch. We made a Ratchet and Clank movie, but it started as a game. I've seen the movie, but not the, uh, not the game. Wow. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I had to... <laughs> I'm cool with that, Mars. I'm cool with that. Yeah, yeah. Very cool with that. Thank you for the quill. <laughs> That's gonna be a fun one for the history books. Okay, you can slide any side of the... You can slide any side of those guys, and it'll be fine. Oh no, go over. Yo, I don't know why, but my fingers are fucking sweaty today. Shit. Fingers are sweaty. It's a great series if you own a PS3. I feel like you rage less than Alt F4. I said the exact same thing, Panda. I rage less than Alt F4. It's because I knew that the game, Alt F4 was designed to make me rage, and so I was like, yeah, it's fine. Uh, this game, I don't feel should be as hard as it is, which is just goes to show you. Here I am. Struggling. You captured the spirit, Mars. Captured the spirit perfectly. Mmm. Completely separate game, totally. Huh. The slide... Uh, here's my complaint. They, the game says slide jump this, slide jump that. The slide jump... Slide jump does not make sense. From a physical standpoint and also from a, like, frame standpoint. Anytime I do it, I'm just, like, hanging out over the edge of the lip for a long time before I decide to jump. It just doesn't work. Like, you can slide jump right off the fucking end of the thing and then still jump at the end of it. It just looks wrong. And that's why I keep failing these crash bandits. Welcome to my TED Talk of why I keep fa failing these crash levels. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Motherfucker. Oh, I see what you're saying, Tub. Okay, okay. I don't have to hit that clock. Oh, I understand. I thought you were being like, you can ignore the clock in the corner of the screen. And I'm like, oh, I mean, I'm ignoring it. I'm just trying to survive. But you mean you can ignore picking it up. Thank you. Thank you. Yo, 11 lives, by the way. Never watched the Ratchet and Clank film. It was shown in school, actually, for me. If that makes... Oh, no. Does that make sense? Stop throwing, please. Jorbin, if I could stop throwing... Oh, my God. It would... My whole life would be easier. And yet, here I am. Cursed to throw. Given no choice. In the matter. My fingers are so fucking sweaty. Yeah? Take me down. Take me down to the paradise city where the grass is green and the girls are pretty. Oh, won't you please take me on? Oh, it's fucking dark. Oh, it's fucking dark. Oh, no. Ratchet and Clank was like stop. Stop motion, right? Is what it's called? Stop motion? Are you playing number four after three? Jorbin, I don't know. This is a great question. It's a great question. I may? I heard that four is hard. Is that... Is that correct? Oh, no. I heard that four was hard.
Oh my god. I just keep pushing. <gasps> mm, can't do that. Tub, I can still see. It may be dark for you guys, but I can still see. I get that it's supposed to be done quickly. I get that. I can still I can still see though when it's gone. So it's like if I'm gonna die, then occasionally I would prefer just to just to live and and take my sweet time. Oh fuck! I jumped too early. <laughs> oh, I think Ratchet and Clank was like kind of early. Was it early? Like, it might be the first stop motion movie I ever ever saw. Four is twenty hours long. Crash Bandicoot 4 is 20 hours long? What the fuck? I mean, we'll have spent 20 hours on the whole trilogy, but like... boy thank you 20 hours long shit give me fruit give me wamba give me wamba it's stretch time chat it's stretch time chat time for big stretch time for big stretch check in with your body big stretch Ooh. It's also okay to do small stretch. Honestly, Jordan, I don't know that I'll do Crash 4 if it's gonna be if it's gonna be 20 hours long. But don't quote me on that because I just love nothing more than giving myself the option. After all two and three are 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 said and done, I would love the option to still do it. So, like most things, I'm once again not gonna. Uh, you know, commit. Um, 12 lives, by the way. 12 lives, by the way. That's almost our PR. Oh! <gasps> okay. So you're not a gamer? Uh, exactly. Actually, that's exactly right. Yeah, yeah, you nailed it. Yep. I'm not a gamer. Hell no. Uh, I have sex, and everything I've ever heard about gamers is that they don't have sex. If you're committed to the gaming cause, you don't have sex. So, unfortunately, not a gamer. Um... Yeah. Just one of those life decisions I made, you know. First off, you motherfucker. Get slid! Get out of here! Oh my god, get slid. <gasps> the PRs! Look at them! 16 fucking lives! I know it's shameful, but... Ryan, that's not very Catholic of you. Uh, I don't know that I've ever done anything in a Catholic manner. Ryan's counting money in front of poor people. You lack Puritanism. I lack both Puritanism and Catholicism. Fuck me. Shit. Well, shit. I think I've probably... I don't... Do these count? If they don't have heart, if they don't have purple crystals, I don't think they count. And I'm not doing them. <clears throat> uh, that's absolutely true. My wife has a boyfriend for pleasure, and I'm here for everything else. Jorbin, <laughs> incredible comment, incredible comment. So those those warp levels are like fun and everything, but here's the deal: we're at 15 out of 25 freaking diamond per gems, and I am I am trying to beat this game today. And so that's what we're doing. Here. Hanging out. While it's fresh in my mind. You have a bunch of lives though, Ryan Reno? Ryan Reno? Ryan Reno? He's wearing shorts. I am indeed wearing shorts today, Pin. It's about 50-50, I would say, most days. Whether I'm wearing shorts or not. And it's hot as balls here. Um, It is very hot weather right now. Here in Indiana. See you, duck. Much love. 
Your boyfriend's a pretty good dude. He got me a PS5. I would say you're playing the system then, in that case. Seems great. Oh, shit. I don't know why these seem so fucking difficult to me. Come at me, bro. I'm just going to slide through everything now. I'm a sliding main. I'm totally joking. He's a dick. With the amount of lives we have, we go slow. We make victory. Make sweet victory love. With the amount of lives we now have, we go slow. We make sweet victory love. I do not care about boxes. I do not care. Oh god, don't come for me. That was the fucking weirdest move I've ever made right there. Can't see shit. There we go. Shit. It's okay. It's raining here, Connor says, obviously. Welcome to England. Rain was- snow was general all over Ireland. Listen, I'm rich as fuck in terms of lives. Oh god. Oh god. What are you doing, you confusing motherfucker? I'm rich as fuck, boy. Got this, we got this, we got this. Hi, Victoria. How's it going? Hello. How are we doing today? Oh, shit. Every time. All right, we're not even going back. We're not even going back, even though it might give us more levels. Honestly, I kind of don't want to even do that. I kind of want to just beat the game. I get it. It's a rough morning. Oh, my God, Victoria. Welcome to the fucking club, dude. I am so sorry you're having a rough day. The good news, if there is any, is that you're not alone. Oh, I'm sorry, Victoria. I think I just broke the game on that one. I don't think that's how that's supposed to work. Cool. Everybody's sad except for McPogs. It's true. Everybody's sad except for McPogs. Every single one of us. I'm sorry you're having a rough morning, Victoria. I hope it gets better. Was that the crystal right outside the bonus level? Was it? Oh, no. Don't say this, mainstream. Don't say this. Don't say this to me. Oh, fuck. Strawberry's doing okay as well. There you go. Shh. Nobody, nobody tell him. Thank God for you, mainstream. Thank God for you. You know, in so many games, I'm like... In so many games, I'm like, backseating? Get it the fuck out. In this game, I'm like, backseat me, please. I want fucking... Backseated to high heaven. Yes, we did it. Let's go. Well, I'm backseated to high heaven. Oh, no. Oh, Victoria. Yes. No, it's not fun. It's not good. Ugh. Happy to help. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. All right, there's one one crystal down, guys. 16 out of 25. It's okay, Ryan. Our whole cult makes me happy. I'm glad that we as a cult can provide that for you. Very glad about that. Oh my god, he shoots explodies. Okay. Oh, they're oh they're in a pattern. Okay. Okay, we got lives for no for days. We got lives for days. It's fine. Okay. All right. Well, never mind. Never mind your Ooga Booga. Oh, God. We lagged. Lagged for a second, though. We're not a cult, though. We're not a cult, despite what the emotes say. We're not a cult. Oh, God. 
Cult gives buff of one pogs per second. Yo, lost. I love that. Hi, Colin. How's it going? Still in the car ride home, Colin? We lagged there. Okay, you can't you can't slide into him. Not when they're like that with the uh, with the thingies out. Turns out, I didn't think he was gonna be, but he was. Welcome in, guys. We're gonna beat Crash Bandicoot today. No questions asked. Can I jump on top of you? Yes. Fifteen lives. We're fucking rich, bitch. We're rich as fuck, boy. Rich as fuck, boy. I don't even need these Wombas. I'm just grab grabbing them because I'm a nice guy. One hour left, Colin says. Hour left of the ride. Great. What's the first thing you're going to do when you get home? Okay, okay, okay. Oh, no. Oh, buddy. It's fine. This guy moves. Okay, I've seen that. Why do I do that every time? I have to slide that! Is beating it today a meme or like actually? I think at our normal pace, uh, Panda, I think we could actually beat it. The problem is we occasionally run into... I think my plan is to actually beat it today. Actual. Actual no memes planning to beat it today. Here's the thing. The... Sometimes you just get one level that makes me stop uh, and spend two hours on it because I suck. Um, and that... Unfortunately, fucks with the timing. Do the plants die if you belly flop on them? Oh, fuck. They do. Nice. Oh, God. Get away. Get away. Um... I know, right, Lost? We talked about that the other day. The motion sickness of watching somebody while you're in the car. Okay, so hear me out here. What if... We're cracked. We're cracked, kid. Slideys? Slideys? Oh god, oh god. Timing that one? Can you just time that one? This is a timing? Oh shit. This is a timing? Oh god. I'm stressing. It's fine though. It's fine. It's fine. The apples give you more lives. Uh, if you reach a hundred of them, the Wombas give you more lives. Yes. If you reach a hundred of them. Oh shit. So right now we got 94. We get six more. We'll get a 15th life. The timing here is weird. Leave me alone. All right, so right now we got 16. At the end of this, all these Wombas will be added to our uh, to our last... Our total outside of the bonus level. And uh, yeah, it'll give you extra lives. And belly flop all those. Cool. Oh my god. Give me that. No, you fucker. Anyways, I lost all my Wombas. But if you die on a bonus round, it doesn't count against you. So you should really not rage. Because it doesn't count against you. <laughs> and yet every time I still fucking rage. Okay, so I think here the play is actually to slide those. Yeah, the other things. The flying shoes, dude, it cracks me up. Yup, yeah, cracks me up. Okay, so hear, hear me out. Um, Wombas is a cute and funny name. Wombas is an actual fruit. All this stuff is Australia. Is Australian. Just like bandicoots, man. The real. It's real shit. Wombas are real. Um, real Wamba. Oops. I don't know how I just did that. Duke taught us, yep. 
That one definitely just says mango. <laughs> Bonus le le levels don't take your lives. But they can take your sanity. Oh, it does. Oh, it does. Oh, God, it does. I don't... I shouldn't care. I have plenty of lives, you know? But it is a cute name, Panda. That does not stop it from being a cute fucking name. You're right about that. Yes, yes. Okay, so you have to... Oops. Oh, no. Oh. I can't get him, and I'm mad. I'm just ignoring it. I'm literally ignoring it. I'm literally ignoring it. Bandicoats, bandicoots are real marsupial-type animals. Whatever that means. It's true. Yeah, they're cute. Very cute. What if he used a jump block? Block the first uh, tower? Oh, it's a bee! I got killed by a bee. I got an achievement for it. They have a Wumba Fruit G Fuel and it's delicious. I just saw that. Alright, so do you mean... No, I'm tempted. No, I'm tempted. Do you mean this panda? Like, um... That? Because if I do that on the... My sanity. It flees from me. Um, It'll blow it up with a TNT. For some reason, and I don't know why. I don't know how I'm doing it. There's a way to like... Yeah, sliding. I think if it's it's if you slide from far enough away, it takes out two. Jumped this on top of it? I could try. I can get at least one of them. Probably. Ooh, it's close. Let me try it. I could probably get the second one too, actually. Woo. Get lined up. Yo, that was it too. I have to fucking stop. I have to stop either caring about it or doing it. One of the two. Marsupials are the ones with the pouches. Any any animal that stores its young in pouches. That sounds like a true fact. Like if that were on a on a quiz show, like hey, true or true or false, I'd be like true. It's not that hard. It's hard. I can get one of them. I need to stop fucking caring. <laughs> what happened on today's stream, Ryan? Well, I sacrificed the chance to actually beat the game today by uh, sweat lording a... <laughs> by sweat lording a bonus level and then raging... You need to get good. I have never seen truer words in my life. If only. Ninja's book keeps promising me I can do it, but I just... Oh! Fuck! Did you guys see that, though? I can slide underneath it, and then it'll just bang on top of my head. Okay, that's interesting. He's in too deep, he can't quit the bonus level? I literally cannot. What was that? I have no idea, but we did it. That was crazy. Oops. Oops. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Oh my god, Dinks isn't here yet, is he? I hope Dinks stops by today. I have the funniest fucking story to tell him. Lost just reminded me. Alright, let's try it again. And by let's try it again, I mean let's fucking run away. I hate I hate my life. I have so many lives. It's, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Why does it matter to me? It matters so much. It matters way too much at this point. All 
All right, hear me out. <sighs> That's good enough for me. 15 lives. I'm just trying to set a, a new life, uh, a PR on lives, you know? That's all. I'm just trying to set a life PR. I'm up to 15. Oh my god, get the fuck away from the bee, please. Get the fuck away from the bee! Oh my god, that's stressful. Guys, yesterday was actually uh, World Bee Day. Did you know that? Oh my god. Hero celebrated by... um. Oh! Hero celebrated by getting scared of a bee outside. Um, And... Down to 14, fuck me. And like kind of being interested in chasing it, but then also kind of avoiding it, thank god. Because if he'd have if he'd have tried to eat it and then got bitten, I'd have been so sad for him and also for us because we'd have probably had to go to like the vet ER or something. Um. Oh, get away! Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh no! Oh no! Okay. How? What do you do here? Can you spin it? Can you s I'm a 13, fuck me. Screw the bees that are aggressive. Screw them, man. Screw them. I hate when bees bite me. Okay. You can't spin the hive. We're gonna learn. We're gonna learn. We're gonna learn today. Earlier, I didn't take the, uh... Earlier, I didn't take the little diversion up here to the left, and now it's no longer available. Otherwise, I'd fucking take it in a heartbeat. That thing right there. <sighs> You're like Spongebob when he was in Sandy's house without his water helmet? Oh, fuck me. I am going to blow your mind, Jorbin. I've never seen Spongebob. Oh my god, I've been saying bite, haven't I? Mainstream. Oh my god. I mean, I meant Sting, obviously. I'm a dumbass. I obviously meant Sting. 13. Please get out of there. Please get out of there. Please get out of there. Get to the fucking checkpoint. Oh my god. I can't believe I said bees that bite. Jim, let's go. Some bees do bite though. Wood bees. 13 lives. We're fucking, we're chilling. And a, and a, and a gym at this point. What did I just do? What did I just do? What did I just? Oh my God. I'm fucking Diglett. That explains why it's this color. I wonder if that still blows me up. If I'm underneath the ground. If I had to guess, I would say that it would. Oh my god, you fuckers. Catch me down here. How about that? Catch me down here. How about that? Oh god! Get the fuck away. Chuck motherfucking points! We're doing it. <sighs> the platform is uh, by getting to it with zero deaths. That's why. That's why it makes sense. That's why it makes sense. Uh, that makes sense, our monkey. Thanks for the clarification. Cause I it has a skull and oh shit and crossbones on it. Oh shit. Oh no, it's a bee. Get the fuck out of here, bee. Get the fuck out of here, bee. Oh god, it's Mario! What the fuck was that? I did see that, Mars. I did see that. I didn't know there was a whole story behind it. Uh, I thought that was the end of the story, but please tell me your would-be story. I would love to hear the hear the would-be story. Can I slide into... Oh no. Oh no. I don't know if I can slide into him, but... Was it Waluigi? It's He's wearing red. Here's the story. A would-be bit me and it hurt real bad. Okay, well. 
I would be, I would be. You'd be a good... You'd be a good would be. You would be a good would... It was funnier in my head. Jumpy, jumpy. Alright, we're testing this once and for all. Nope. Fuck. Oh shit, run. Oh my god, he's a he's a lumberjack. Mario lumberjack, that's what he is. Why? Victoria, I fucking loved your meme. It was really fucking cute. Charlie bit me. Victoria, I love the meme so much. How do I kill bees in this game? Can I spin the actual bee? Come here, motherfucker! I cannot spin him. I cannot spin him. Oh. Cass says, I need a little advice, you guys. My friend is going down to the shore this weekend for her birthday. She invited me to come along. I want to go, but I'm not super familiar with her friend group. In addition, my boyfriend doesn't trust the people I'd be going down on the shore with. But he said he'll support my decision, even though I know he'd be upset. I'm not sure if I should go with my friend or not, because it'll make my boyfriend upset. Hmm, okay. Let me think on that real quick, Kat. For real, that was a couple years ago, and I was on the back deck at my parents' house. Woodby came up and was flying in our faces. My mom's like, they don't have stingers. You'll be fine. My sister swung at it with a racket, landed on my leg, fucking bit me. Hurt for days. That sucks. If I die on this fucking B level with 15 lives... Wow, Mars. Woodbees, man. Who'd have thunk? With eight lives... All right, Kat, uh, how much, how much would you say, how much time would you say you and your boyfriend have spent talking about this? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. How to kill bees, crash bandicoot two. Like 10 minutes. I just got the call right now. I think this is a I think this is a circle back around and have the conversation some more. Um I think this is a I think this is a circle back around. Wait, how do you do it? Wait, there's a what? There's an easy way to get 99 lives and you have to bug out the bees. Bees. Crash, cr crash Bandipedia. Bandicootpedia. The bees can be defeated by a spin attack. Okay. I just tried to show you guys and it wasn't, it wasn't showing. I'm sorry. I tried to show you guys on the screen, but I forgot. Crash Bandipedia. Uh, Mars, did you hate your sister for that? Cat, uh, Victoria says, is there any specific reason why he doesn't trust him? Do they encourage actions that would possibly be bad for the relationship? He thinks they party too hard and are bad influences. He's never met any of them and only heard stories. That could be part of the reason. I don't think anything would jeopardize a relationship. He doesn't feel safe or wouldn't give him peace of mind if I go. Yeah, I... Oh my god, come back here, motherfucker. Get out! That gives me such more peace of mind. Oh god! They can pop come back out. Okay. Uh, here's my take, uh, Cap. I think this is a swing back around. And I think why you swing back around here is I think... I think... Whether or not you go is, is somewhat the least important question now. I think the more important question is why... Oh shit. Is why... Why your boyfriend feels the way that he does? We did it. And I think talking through that is the important part. And like establishing all of the links, what I would call like the links in the trust chain. So like I would sw I would try and swing back around and not from a like perspective of like we're figuring out what I'm doing this weekend. More from a perspective of like we're figuring out why we feel the way yes, we do. Both I of us. Much time. One second. Cortex has almost completed the new space station. 
Something's not right with his Something's not right, guys. Where are the tricks he's trying? Beware of the tricks, man. So, because that takes the pressure off. If you're not trying to decide something, you're just talking. That's that's. Uh, I think it takes the pressure off. And then the thing I would do is try and figure out like, so what? A, what part of is it that that we? What part of it is it that we agree agree on, and what part do we do we see differently on so far? So including, like. So one, we both know that I'm not going to do anything stupid, right? We both trust that. If the, if the yes is there, then we move a step further, which is like, we do both know, you know, we know that I'll be able to call you, like, I can call you if I need help, or like, I can get out, I can take care of myself if I need to. You can go along that part of the chain, and then you get to the step, which is like, so we have slightly different opinions on how my friends, on how safe or responsible or whatever my friends are, right? And then we, t and then we talk through that. We talk through that. And we get down to like, what it is specifically about it he doesn't trust or or would feel better about and then in some ways like in my opinion in some ways this is kind of how Megan and i do stuff anyways who knows if it works for you guys nice in some ways the like decision at the end is like the least consequential part and just kind of happens as a part of the conversation because of what you figure out along the way you know okay we got some slidey boys uh not to be super personal here. I put out a trigger warning. Mm. He doesn't want me to be involved in that, and I know I won't. Nothing stupid. I know my friend will be able to keep me safe. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right, and I think that's also what Mars just said, I think, is probably a thing you could you could walk through during the conversation. Because I think I think that's the thing you can feel too, right? Is like it does make sense for anybody to be a little worried. But I don't know that that's necessarily the stopping spot for the conversation. But I think it might be a, a place, uh, one of the one of the steps along the way, right? Oh my god, we're getting cracked at this game. They put these here, and I'm doing them just because I want to prove that I'm like I'm getting better at Crash. Pena, I appreciate you saying that, by the way. I don't know. I like to talk a big game. Who knows if I'd actually be any help, but... Ah! Okay. I jumped. Makes me mad. I've been in a similar boat, Cat, where, like, I had friends that, like, to a, a different, potentially, degree, but, like, I had friends that were objectively, like, bad influences. But I also think that if, like, if the trust is there, then... It almost doesn't, to a degree, it almost does not matter. I'm trying to think how to word this right. Because what I don't mean is that, like, trust solves all these things. We're down to six fucking lives. Seven fucking lives. But, um... Like, it's not that more trust is always better. But it's that you have to have a really firm grasp of where, where the trust... Is it that he doesn't trust them? Is it that he doesn't trust you? Is it that he doesn't trust how far he would be from you? There's like a lot of different things to trust is what I mean by the trust chain, if that makes sense. And I think that's where... Is this the end? There's no way this is the end. Oh, okay. It's just a platform. I think that's what I'm trying to say is like, this isn't a question of like, he doesn't trust you enough. Um, although if that's the issue, then maybe that's an issue to work through. <laughs> But more so, like, where in the process is the trust breaking down? Okay. This scares me. Oh! Okay, it scared me for good reason. Okay, I almost did the exact same fucking thing. Oh, shit. Sure, sure. Cat, I'm not sure if this helps, but I hardly know you, and I'm not worried for you. I just said that because because uh, I don't think it's fair at all of us. I, I don't think it's that fair at all of us. 
I'm a, I'm about as worried about you. Are we worried or not? Uh, I don't think it's. I'm I'm certainly not going to go as far to say that I'm worried for you because of what you told us. Because I know that that's not the full story and the etc 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 and I can't know you and etc. So, um, shit, dude, I'm getting smacked, I'm getting smacked around. Yeah, I mean it's not a great thing to hear, of course, but like, guys, I have sweat. This is disgusting. I have sweat all around my fucking joystick. There's like sweat. Oh my god, like dried sweat. Dried sweat. Inside of the joystick. Oh my god, that's disgusting. I get so fucking hand sweaty controller clinchy playing this game. It's disgusting. Hi, Harry Potato Chips. How's it going? <laughs> yeah, for sure, Victoria, for sure. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. I heard dried sweat. Oh! I heard dried sweat. There's literally dry... Like, it's... I would show you, but it's disgusting. There's dried sweat on my joystick. On the, on the part where your thumb goes, on the joystick. Yeah, I don't know that we can give you an answer, cat, but I think we can give you a... Sweat all over my joystick. You can sweat all over my joystick. What? You fucker! Thanks for the five bits, Victoria. I don't know that we can give you an answer, but I think that we can give you, like, some grounding levels of concern. Maybe potential approaches, you know? How did I get smashed right there? I'm, I'm gonna rage. I'm gonna rage. I'm gonna rage. I'm gonna rage. I don't know what you're talking about, about Victoria. Hi, Springit. How's it going? I just get buffering nonsense using data on my phone while at work. No. No. I have no idea if Springit can actually see streams. So I'm going to type that. Um, you're right, Victoria. It does sound like an innuendo, unfortunately. Okay. Get me out here. Get me out here. Okay. All right, we have that figured out. This, that does not. Mm, okay, we're not raging. That does not look like it will hit me. I just wanna, I just wanna express my disappointment because that does not look like it will hit me. I don't think it actually has to be so like pit, like frame perfect as I'm making it, but like. Give me alive, please. No lives. Okay. How do I go over to that thing? Oh, I go down, right? I go down. Yes. Bonus. Okay. We need the lives. We need the lives. For sure. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Well, RIP that. I think there's generally a bigger question too, Cat, where it's like, are these high school friends? These strike me as probably high school friends. Are they high school friends? Okay, we're chilling there. All right, well, fuck me. High school friends I haven't connected with in a while. So I think the thing you're going through is the Everybody with high school friends ever. Oh God. Oh no. Everybody with high school friends ever, which is like your high school friends are your friends because of proximity, which is not different from your college friends who are also friends because of proximity very often. However, your high school friends are generally like you have very limited options in, in, within that proximity. It doesn't make them less real friends. It just kind of the reason for them becoming your friend. Uh, will you? How do I kill you? There we go. Um, so then sometimes there can be a question of like, so what makes? Am I going to keep this friendship alive or am I going to let it kind of pass? Uh, pass because of time. Um. 
And real question. Yeah. And uh Oh shit. Okay, well. Uh yeah, very real question. Uh and I don't know ever I don't know that I've handled it like that I know any good answers to that, and I also don't know that I've handled it well in my life. So oh my god. This is fun. I didn't have high school friends, so ha, losers. Thank you for that advice. I've been struggling with that for a while. I mean, I hope it was advice. I don't know. I hope it wasn't just avoiding the question. So I felt a little bit like I did that, but... Oh, shit. Give me your... Give me your Woombas. Fuck. <laughs> yeah. Spriggan, I have no idea if you can hear me, but uh, I hope work's going okay. Yeah. So I think it's I think it's like my my take on high school friends has always been like my take on high school friends has always been like they can the bonds there can be particularly deep um because they knew you before you were you, you know? Um they can also be sometimes. I think that also can give them a chance to be problematic in a ways that many other friendships can't because you knew them bef you knew them while your judgment was clou more clouded than it currently is and their judgment was more clouded than it currently is and also like you you let the longevity be the glue where another friendship would have fallen apart uh we're down to three lives. Remember all those lives we had, chat? Oh, fuck that. I don't know. Maybe no part of that resonates with you. Give me a Wombas or the Bandicoot who gets it. High school friend problems is the TED talk we're having right now. Yes. Falling apart. We are falling apart. Uh, yeah. Does anybody else have those friends? Like high school friends where you're like, oh man, you're probably like pretty bad for me but you also i have a friend i have a friend who how do i say this okay um i have two friends let's let's compare them i have two friends one who has known me since i was literally three years old uh we were we were we call each other like we were each other's first friends like we were pre-k before pre-k even i think technically like we were each other's first friends um he is a like a great dude and has turned into a great beautiful human and so it's really easy to still be friends with him um there were a couple friends along the way who i made around the same time who i kept for many years um but who i don't uh who i had a tough time but i did end up i had a tough time doing so but i did end up like ending the friendships there um because it turns out the thing that was holding them together was like, we've been friends forever, man. And I'm like, and part of that is like, it's more than just, we've been friends the longest. Like you just measure it in terms of time. It's also like, I have, I have core memories with this person, you know, because of how long we've been friends. But also it just wasn't the play in the long run. Oh my god, that fucking... I knew there would be a third one. I was trying to see it. Okay. You should come here and then go back. There we go. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Give me a fucking checkpoint, please. I need to beat this shit. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Checkpoint! Let's go. Come at me. Come at me. Come at me. I had a best friend for 10 years, thought of him like a brother, lost him to a new group of friends who does some hardcore drugs. Now we don't even know each other. Uh, I cut out all my high school friends out of my life. Couldn't be happier. Well, you, were you were just talking about that earlier, Panda. Were those high school friends you were talking about earlier? Harry says the only friends... I'm only friends with middle school peeps. So almost 20 years. Yeah. I mean, most of my... To be fair, actually, I keep calling them high school friends. But most of my high school friends were no longer friends. Uh, I didn't really have... I had friends that I carried over from elementary school. I had no real... 
I didn't really have any friends I made in high school. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I'm fucking nervous. No! Hi, Linux. How's it going? You bitch. Two lives left. Three lives, technically, if you count the one I'm on. Oh my god, Cat! You just made me think of the entire. I left the other entire half of the of the conversation, uh, on the on the table. Oh my god. Okay, so Cat says there have definitely been people I cut off because I realized they were toxic as hell. Others I know inertly good. I know are inertly good, just make bad choices. The friend I was talking about in the ladder is in the ladder, and I know she cares for me and she respects my decision. Cat, thank you. This was the other part of what I was gonna say. Okay, so how did we go from 15 lives to two? I love you too, Victoria. Thank you so much. Yeah. Um. Yep. We're moving really slowly. This is the other part I was going to say, is there's the friends from, from early on that you cut off, but then there's also, and this can be, this I think might be the most rare type of friendship because, at least for me, I have I have exactly one of these people. And it's the one I was talking about earlier. Um, is that like, there were definitely periods where I was like, I distrust most of what you're going through. I like what, what you're doing uh, right now. But I also have faith that you uh that you're coming around and like you're showing me along the way that you're a good person and that oh no oh god oh god and then if you can survive that stretch where there's like potentially bad choices or hanging out with the wrong group or whatever um on the other side of that is like a really beautiful thing it's a really beautiful thing you know because you've because you haven't just fair weather friended which is the least generous way to phrase that you haven't fair weather friended You've been there for all of it. And that is really beautiful. Um, I can't believe I forgot the second half of the story. And maybe that's the case with what's going to be happening here, you know, Cat? Like, maybe this is one of those. But it's also tough to know sometimes. How do I get over there? Well, I go up and then left. Up and then left? No? I can only hope? I hope. Linux says I have yet to make meet someone... Who wants to be friends with me nope i have yet to meet someone who wants to be with me outside of school i didn't have a lot of that either lennox i had very little hi hi god how's it going oh why though why we're gonna die on this you jump in from the previous blocks Oh, no, that was longer than I thought. Mainstream, did you send a long message? Did you send a long message? Because long messages sometimes take forever to show up, and I haven't seen it yet. The way she's texting me right now is very understanding, and she's offering other alternatives to hang out other than interacting with the worrisome group. There you go. That all strikes me as... as fantastic. Okay, we have to make an effort to get every single... Um... Every single one but along the way, because we need every uh, extra life that we can. It should come eventually, mainstream. Sometimes they just take a second. Hi, Seb. How's it going? Congrats on the new job, Seb. Yo, let's go. Hi, Evan. How we doing? Congrats and condolences to our friend. You jump in here from here? Oh, I thought it was behind ice, Victoria. I understand. Thank you my grip on reality evan thank you so much for the follow i hope you're having a great day man shut the fuck up please i'm not sure i will accept it i know right r.i.p to your reading time am i just driving it in to the ground at this point i think i might be you fucker i should have jumped up i'm mad i'm mad is ryan not streaming tonight there's no plan to stream no plan to stream Mainstream, I really hope it shows up, the message. <laughs> it hasn't shown up yet. If you can scroll up and copy pasta it into two pieces, maybe? I don't know. I feel bad. You, you spent all this time writing a long comment, and now it's not showing up. Are you going to play some games with viewers sometime? Linux, I'm playing games with viewers all weekend, my friend. Saturday? Great question. Saturday? Uh, we're doing Gardic Phone at 7 p.m. Chat, remind me to keep saying this throughout the day. Gardic phone is at 7 p.m. this weekend uh, on Saturday, Eastern Standard Time. So I know that's hard for EU people. We're playing Valorant with friends. 
Valorant with friends Sunday at 1 p.m. Uh, Meg won't be there, but everybody else. Uh, but I'll be there. Everybody else. I'll be there. So yeah, come play some Valorant if you want, Linux. We'll rotate people in and out. I'm going to try to get Fiance to play tomorrow. I hope she does, Mars. Please tell her I personally would be the happiest human on this side of the planet if she would if she would do it in the northern hemisphere i don't know what i'm saying only when i'm sleeping are you sleeping at 7 p.m on sunday seven p.m on a sunday night you're sleeping hmm it's an interesting choice you sleep whenever you want to but we did specifically do two days that way so that people come from EU and also NA could could show up to one of them. The only time I had to cut... Oh, shit. There it goes, mainstream. The only time I had to... No, it's 1 p.m. here, Linux. 7 p.m. for you. On Sunday. 1 p.m. here. 7 p.m. for you. On Sunday. 6.59 p.m. is my bedtime on Sundays. Mainstream says the only time I had to cut friends out of my life... I got you, Linux. I got you. Uh, was it they directly did something we couldn't talk it out like I had one friend that talked crap about me behind my back all the time I was telling everyone in town I stole from her and all this other stuff but she wouldn't talk to me about it when I confronted her she just denied it so I was like bro I'm not gonna keep hanging out and doing favors if you're just talking crap about me we can't even work it out like what gives the end I love it I love it Saturday or Sunday okay so thank you for asking goth here's the here's the deal I don't think I can technically get this do you want me to try it I'm going to try it. Uh, hi, Artix. Did you get Jim on death route in all boxes? Uh, no, 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 no. We're just trying to barely beat the game. Like the worst possible. Oh, God. Oh, we did it. Okay. So Saturday, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We're going to play some garlic phone. Garlic phone. All of this is in the Discord, the announcement page of the Discord. FYI, if you miss out, it's right there. Saturday, 7 p.m. Uh, garlic phone. If you've never played garlic phone before, it's super fucking fun. And then Sunday, 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, we will play... Um, Valorant. Isn't garlic... Uh, isn't Valorant cross-region? It is uh, no cross-play, so you'd have to get a, uh, a VPN. But we have some people from EU play on VPNs. Oh! No! Oh! How do we do this? Is there a way to do it? Fuck me, by the way. Another news I submitted a data profile report to my supervisor. Mmm, interesting cat. Very interesting. That sounds frustrating. I get to gather some momentum and just slide the whole way through. I'm into it. I'm into it. I can't get a VPN. Sorry to hear that, Linux. Then it sounds like we are not doing, uh, it sounds like we are not doing play with viewers at a time that works for you this weekend. Sorry about that. Fuck me, by the way. Thank you, uh, Victoria, for the five bits. Um, I'm sorry that- <gasps> Brian is a fuck- I'm sorry that Brian won't read, uh, he's a, he's a Puritan and he, and he won't read fuck. Thanks for the five bits, though. Yeah, that makes sense, Tub. Oh, dude, you nailed it, Panda. You nailed it. Thank you. I appreciate that. Fuck me, by the way. There you go. I got there you, go. you, Victoria. There you go. There you go. Thank you, Mars, for the five bits. Fuck me, by the way. I'll make him read whatever I want him to read. <gasps> oh, that was so close. Oh, my heart. Oh, thank you, Victoria, for the five bits. 